are the absolute worst to do radio dramas because we don't forgot voices. We don't stumbled over lines. Speak for yourself. Every... I think I'm doing a good job. Sorry, I am. Welcome back to Button Smashing. Mm -hmm. I am your host, Spotted Menace, sitting right beside the very arrogant Daria. It's not being arrogant. It's being confident. Arrogant? Yes, arrogant. See, see, like. It's being confident in my talent. Or like. I have many talent or lack thereof. Wow. <laughs> you walked into that one. I don't know why. You, why are you surprised? What? Why are you surprised at all? Wow. You're welcome. Wow. Just going to minimize my lines. All I right. Sure did. You know what? We're just going to get into this. Mm -hmm. I'm not optimistic at all, actually. Hey, Nick. It's time. Okay. Let's go. Sigh. S I G H. I'm not you. What does that mean? Please don't sigh like that. Because he's, right. he's the one who did the uwas. <laughs> you know, I'm gonna switch, switch to like Rowan Reigns doing go ooh ah. How about that? Yeah, it sounds better than having orgasms. I, I would take that. I mean, like I've heard people have that orgasm too. Well, then there you go. I guess we've figured out every the every th epidemic. Like, there is a spectrum of vinegar strokes. Okay, I'm just saying. Do they taste like vinegar strokes, or you just call them vinegar strokes? Because I'm not understanding why you keep saying vinegar strokes. Because vinegar. We, we, what is vinegar like a like some type of liquid? Court will now reconvene for the trial of Mr. Will Bowers. I am ignoring you, Mr. Edgeworth. Will you present the prosecution's thoughts on this matter? I'm just saying vinegar strokes. It's like a liquid. You can't stroke liquid. D. The prosecution's thoughts are simple. Nothing has changed. The other person who went to the studios was a boy of roughly 10 years of age. Yes, because she said second and third grade. The photo we do have may not be hard evidence, but there is still no one else that could have committed this crime. I call for a verdict of guilty, guilty. for the defendant, Mr. Will Powers. As he strokes his vinegar strokes. Oh, I'll HMM. Come on. Hmm. Ooh, now I got the hiccups. Very well, Mr. Riot. Oh, shit. The defense disagrees with the prosecution's claim. There is another person who could have committed this crime. Robble, 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 cabble. Order. Interesting. Let us hear who you have in mind. However... Be aware that this court does not look kindly on a cute motherfucker. This motherfucker did not just say we do not look kindly on accusing the innocent when like the past three cases we've had, motherfuckers have been innocent. And this Edgeworth mm -hmm. has still had a job. Mm -hmm. So what the hell does that even mean? We don't look kindly on accusing the innocent. The frick? <laughs> What, how does that manifest it into anything? No, it doesn't. It it's like, 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 okay, so you don't take Holly on accusing the innocent. What are you going to do? You're not doing shit to Edgeworth, so you ain't going to hold me in contempt. I can accuse whoever the hell I want then. If he's accused, I was on trial. We're going to move on. I was on trial when they all knew my ass was innocent. Mm -hmm. They still, they still. That's some shit. If you accuse someone who is obviously innocent, you will be penalized. This is why I'm going to be a lawyer when I grow up. <laughs> right. Great. As if the stakes weren't high enough. So who is this person? Why uh, is that blinking red? We haven't even... I know, I know. Just oh, it's kill. just blinking? It's just blinking for a Oh, now. I was going to say, like, don't ding me, asshole, and I haven't even answered the question, okay, jackass. Okay, I was say. It's just saying that if we choose the wrong person, that's how much we lose. No, go frick yourself with that. We're going to go to the security lady. That's the only other person I can think of. So who is the person other than... Security the... lady. I know, I was just reading the question. Wow. Uncalled for. It was the security lady, Wendy Oldbag. Who? The steel samurai is dragging his leg in this picture. 
That means whoever was in the suit knew about the morning in it. Maybe because they had been watching the action scene run through. Frick myself. There was only one person other than Powers and Hammer who knew about the injury. The security lady, Old Bag. What, what? Whippersnapper? Rabble, rabble, gabble, gabble. Order, order. Is this true, Old Bag? Old Bag? That's Miss Old Bag to you. Ms. Old Bag was standing guard alone at the main gate. She was by herself. In other words, she has no alibi. She could have briefly left her post to steal the Steel Samurai costume. Then slipped into Studio One, the scene of the murder, yeah. murder! Murder! Hey, hey, we, we, we got all that in one go. That was good, way to go. Well, why would she go through the trouble of wearing a Steel Samurai costume? Simple, Your Honor. She knew the camera at the gate would take her picture. If she was in his costume, oh, she could so point vibrating. the finger at Mr. Powers. The, there, the, you, I, oh, I see. Stop vibrating my controller. I'm not gonna You're stop doing it. that on I'm purpose. Not, I, I'm not the one making it vibrate. Yes, I'm, you are. I'm just not You're shutting it off. You're mad because you don't know how to distinguish your orgasms for real acting. Can you hit X, please? Yes. For excellent deductive reasoning, Mr. Wright. Thank you, Mr. Judge. Oh, yeah. Right there, Sherlock Holmes. See, or why is it, everything in ooh, orgasm? It's, nothing was about that. It's was oh, it's not ooh, it's oh. Oh, yes, not oh, ooh. It, it is oh, my bad. Oh, my that, God. That, that's, that's, I misread that. I, I do apologize. Da, 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 question mark. That's odd. Isn't this the part where Edgeworth pounces? I let him pounce on me all day. Yes, so stop vibrating my controller. Does he usually jump up with an objection and some new damning evidence? Well, Mr. Edgeworth, does the prosecution have an opinion on this matter? Dots, dots, dots. The prosecution has no meaningful objections at this time. Wait, what? You have actually nothing to say? Finger tap, finger tap. Keep going. What? What? What's that supposed to mean? It means you are scared. Oh, so you all think I did it. Is that it? Edgy boy. Don't just sit there. Do something. What's my move? Maybe now's my chance to take this the whole way. Press further, yeah. Press further? Yeah, keep going. Okay. Push her ass. Fuck her. <laughs> the very same reasoning that makes Mr. Powers a suspect in this case can be used to cast doubt on Ms. Oldbag's actions on that day. But, but why would I do something so horrible to poor Hammer? Pause. We never even brought up motive. Nope. Like, there's literally no motive. No, we're just casting. For, for Will Powers to do, to, to kill Jack Hammer. There's no motive. Well, she, no, actually, technically there is. She said he was getting old. And they were getting ready to replace him. They're getting ready to replace Jack Hammer, not Will Powers. Well, I guess they're taking it as Will Powers is being... I don't know. No, Will Powers was, was like... Well, that's what she said, okay? No, she said that they were about to replace Jack Hammer, not Will Powers. Whatever. It's, it's, so that there's no motive for Will no, Powers to not. kill Jack Hammer. No, it's not. So, like, what is this judicial system? I they didn't even bring up... You need mo op motive opportunity. Means motive opportunity. This is how I'm going to be a lawyer when I grow up. The frick? Link and comment down below if you want to be a lawyer when you grow up, because I do. Jesus Christ. Okay, keep going. You forget that Mr. Powers lacks a clear motive, too. Thank you, Phoenix. Thank you. Huh. Indeed. That did it. Now Windbag is one of the suspects. No hard feelings. I hope. Oh, she's cutting your dick off, dude. Pro Why is it always a dick? Wait, just a minute. What about the other person who went into the studio? The boy. The one whose photo I erased. We got no proof that you actually technically erased it. We just got your testimony. Check. He's only a grade schooler. 
Though, yeah, as you said, second or third grade, was it? That, that doesn't matter. When I was that age, I could fit my own man in 10 seconds tops. Damn, what the hell were you doing? What today? were you doing? We're gonna skip past that. Please. Hmm. Your thoughts, Mr. Wright? That boy is not the killer. What? How can you be so sure? Oh. Is it be nice the kids and mean to your elders day, whippersnapper? That's a weird sentence. Yeah. I have proof. P proof? Indeed. But let's see this proof, Mr. Wright. You have proof that shows a boy could not have committed this murder? Well, they said that the spear was too heavy. Yeah. Honestly, I don't even think that that spear is technically the murder weapon. But keep, keep going. Uh, go, so to, we go to the spear. So we're still going to present the spear? Yeah, we're going to present the spear. Why would we still do that if it's for a third grader? Because we're proving that it's too heavy. Okay. So present, present it. it. Yeah, go it's ahead. Circle? Triangle. Oh, right. Take that. Okay. Take that. Your Honor. The murder weapon was a samurai spear. That very spear is shown here in this photo. It is. That's the exact yeah. same spear. How could the boy have taken the spear? It's impossible. Also, how could he fill out that costume? He can't. He's too young. And I see. It's too many gaps. Yeah, there's way too many gaps. Well, would the witness care to comment on this? MRPH. The windbag. Speechless. This has got to be a first. Very well. Gavel. This court will suspend proceedings on the current trial for today. And I think button smashing should do. Because we're getting to the good part. Yeah, we're starting to get to the good part. And I don't want to cut it off later on. Yeah. So we will catch y'all later. Scissors. Bye. Wait, scissors? Yeah, that's deuces. Like scissors. You do the two fingers, like piece, and it's like scissors. Like paper, rock, scissors, and you just cut. So you say deuces, which is the two fingers, which is scissors. Yeah. I just thought about that. It's pretty awesome. The way, fascinating way of mind working. You just act like I'm killing you right now. Goodbye. <laughs>